You hear that? That is my across the way neighbor who got evicted. They had they had bed bugs. Yay. Whoop did he do? Whoop did he do? This is the lady that did not work. She had like five kids and was pregnant. And she had kids of every color, nationality, which is fine. She likes, she likes being different. But I knew she had bed bugs because they literally would keep junk, blankets, towels, beds, mattresses, out on their patio for months before she got evicted. Great. This trick, like, I don't mean to judge, but you could just look, sometimes look, look at somebody and know that they're funky and dirty. This bitch was dirty and she had no business having like five kids and then one on the way because she had a baby when she was up in there and she, she didn't even live there a year. So I don't know what the hell they were doing over there. Look, you can get bed bugs. Anyone could get bed bugs. It's a national epidemic now. But I knew she had bed bugs. I knew that bitch had bed bugs. But you could just look at her and tell, and she'd be out on the patio scratching and shit, and her babies be scratching. I'm not a judgy person. I'm so not a judgy person. I'm fat myself. I am six feet tall. I look like a monster. Trust me. You can't say anything to me that I have not already heard all my life. But that bitch was nasty. That trick was nasty. And she just did not care. And now they have to spray for bed bugs. And I thank the Lord Jesus that she did not live on top of me. Because her kids were horrible. They would like literally fling themselves over the balcony. She had like six kids. Then she had some other crazy girl like living with her. I don't know if it was her sister. I don't know if it was like her friend. I have no idea. But that bitch was nasty. Bed bug bitch. And I'm not saying that any, you know, anybody can get bed bugs. It's not a poor person thing. It's not a ghetto person thing. Rich people could get bed bugs. If you buy something at a secondhand place, even now today, I've heard that like even new materials have bed bugs in them sometimes because it's such an epidemic. They're hard to kill, but that bitch was gross and she's gone now. She got evicted. Like she lived there like eight months. How do you not work and get assistance and still get evicted? I, I don't get it. And then have bed bugs on top of that. I don't understand. I don't understand. If I had assistance, which I did at one time, I've had assistance before. I've had food stamps before. I've had, you know, assistance. I kept my house clean as shit. If I even saw a bug, I'd be like, oh, no, uh-uh, no. It's called, you have too many children. You have too many children. Stop having kids. Maybe then you can focus on your house and not have bed bugs. If you see a bug, then you can nip it in the bud. But she didn't do that. Clark Smith Adventures. Bye. I don't mean to be judging. I'm sorry if I'm judging. But I'm glad to see that girl gone. She was gross. And her kids, her poor children, I felt bad for her kids. Because they literally would wear the same outfit for like a week. Someone should have called social services on those people. But I don't think anyone did. Because the last time I saw her, she was moving. And she had like people helping her move. Which was nice. But 
Yeah, she's bed bug bitch. Bed bug bitch. A bed bug bitch. La 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 la.